this tutorial. Now, I'll be very honest with you, I wasn't planning on creating a tutorial today, but I've just been testing the whole morning this new feature called Tune, so Tuner on Midjourney. And you know what? I have to record this to show you how you can completely elevate your artwork to a different level. So guys, we're going to be focusing on Christmas stuff, as I promised you. So we're going to be creating Christmas clip art and we're going to be creating such styles that, well, I personally haven't seen colors like that before. So I hope you're excited and let's get started. Guys, welcome back. And you know what? I'm so excited. I don't even know where to start. Okay, well, you know what? Let's just start in my gallery so that I, sh I can show you what's possible. Now, guys, I have joined me journey in January 2023. And I can honestly say that this is so far my favorite, favorite feature that ever came out. So I just want to make sure that I am sort of on the newest. And let's take a look at some of these colors. Okay, well, I'm going to start from here. So we're just going to be looking at my watercolor. So guys, the prompt, very, very simple, Christmas scene watercolor, uh, watercolor pastel colors, and then it just adds a style. And I'll show you how I got to these styles, but just take a look at these, right? I mean, the colors are just mesmerizing. I honestly don't know how I would create these colors if I didn't have the stylized function. So, oh my goodness. Um, so, so beautiful. <laughs> yeah, I've been trying and testing different styles. It's just, oh, mesmerizing, right? And you know what? I have searched Etsy for similar styles. I couldn't find these. So, yeah, just mesmerizing. Look at these colors, right? Oh, and then I did these. These are more simple. Then I, um, I show you a different style that I was trying. Just beautiful. And uh, of course, we can then further edit it in Canva, take away the elements that um, we don't want. This is more simple, minimalist. Also very beautiful. As you know what, I'm in love with this new website as well. So this is sort of like, this kind of watercolor is stunning because it sort of like gives you that smudge on top. Um, again, this, I don't know how I would normally do it. So can you see these smudges, like uh, the top of it, I'm guessing it's sort of like mixed combination uh, with another art technique, I don't know, maybe dry sponge. Look at these, right? Such beautiful, rich colors and texture and everything just perfect. Yeah, trying different styles. Guys, I'm just so excited with this feature, you know, like I'm not going to stop playing around with this. And probably, you know, I'm still new to it. I'm still learning. But if I find uh, different things that it can do, I'm definitely going to make another tutorial on that. I mean, look at this, right? All that reflection in that lake. Oh, lovely. Just love it. So again, minimalist. And then I'm going to go to really rich colors. Yeah, so this is sort of like more pastel hues. Again, very, very beautiful. Yeah, literally doesn't need any more like color editing at all. It's just gorgeous as it is. And again, like I, I don't know how I would create something like this without this uh, stylized function. It's tuna. So beautiful, right? You know what? I will just be looking at it all day. <laughs> it's just gorgeous. Yeah. Right, guys. So are you ready to see how I made this? I hope you are. So let's get started. Okay, I'm just going to close these, guys. So the first things first, you go to your Discord, of course, and you press Tune. Uh, first things first, guys, you need to be on the fast mode. So I've got it open here as well so that I can show you. So here I had to switch to fast mode, but it takes a little bit of your arrows away, but then you can sort of like go to, <clears throat> excuse me, relax mode to work on your styles. I'll show you how. So you just go to prompt and just type in, basically I, I typed in here a very simple prompt, just watercolor, Christmas scene, clip art, watercolor, pasta colors and white background. That was my prompt, yeah. 
so you 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 basically do it here and then you press enter and then this comes up this this feature here yeah so create style tuner and then it tells you you know how much it will cost you these fast hours you know which is absolutely fine and then you just press submit so i've done it already so that we don't have to go through that again but basically you can pick between 16 32 i've gone for 32 here so it's creating 64 jobs and then you get this message it takes a little while but then you get this message uh, saying that style tuner is ready you click on it and then it takes you here and here is where your styles are so guys this can seem a little bit complicated but it's very very simple so you just have a look at all the styles and pick the one or the ones that you like and again, guys, working with it is very simple. So I just click on this and then copy. And then I just go to Mid Journey and paste it here. And it's creating my, uh, hold on, let me just, oh yeah. So I have to do the imagine normal prompt, sorry. So, and it's now going to be creating my uh, favorite style. Of course, I haven't stopped yet. So I'm just going to, redo it again and I'm going to try maybe different styles so I click on it I again copy and then go over to my discord and again going to pop that style in here when we are on relax hours we can actually run three jobs at the same time so I'm currently running two this is getting you see the um, you know like when you get to um you know, sort of like a quiet time, like let's say now it's Saturday morning, um, it's really, really fast anyway. So, you know, it's absolutely no problem being in relaxed mode, but look at these colors. Oh my goodness, all kinds of pinks and blues and just gorgeous, right? I mean, you know, if you are selling on Etsy or Creative Fabrica, you know, this is definitely going to elevate your artwork to another level. I mean, normally I would have to use Canva or Photoshop to, to sort of like reach those kind of colors and this is also quite beautiful look at it i mean you know obviously everybody will have different ideas of what they want to create so um again i'm going to <laughs> pick another of my styles so again i can just uh start again oh my god these are just some minimalist styles this is quite nice let's try this one copy i'm just going to pop it here imagine you can see guys very simple and you can literally spend all day doing this you know it's just so so beautiful again i'm going to rerun it this is quite nice these minimalist styles these are very very colorful these ones again something quite unusual these are quite nice oh my god so literally this is probably more like traditional let's try that see what comes up I'm going to pop it over to my me journey imagine of course, if you want to do additional like styling, like uh, parameters, like um, how big we want it or any other changes we can. Um, so we are running a different style here. Let's take a look at that. Again, very, very beautiful. You know what? I can just imagine this on postcards and Christmas cards, just stunning. Um, we are getting that one done. Okay. Now let's see what else we can try. Oh my God, this is really nice, isn't it? But you can't see a thing. I did these. So these ones I showed you, it's full of pinks, beautiful colors. Okay, let's see what it gives us. Oh, this is sort of like more traditional, you know, but still very beautiful. Look at these colors and look how crisp it is, right? I mean, that's what's so mesmerizing about these that literally we don't need to do any more sharpening or editing. Just love it. I really love it. You know, I think this is so far my favorite, favorite feature of me journey. Um, and we can just go on, you know, like try and test. If you're not happy, we can do it again. Again, these are quite funky here. Yeah. Look at this purple, purples. Let's just copy it and see what it looks like. Oh my goodness. What happened here? Okay. So let's go to imagine. And then we're just going to pop that in. Um, what else can we try, you guys? So I'm just going to redo it. And this is quite cute as well. This this probably would be very beautiful colors. This is sort of, again, more minimalist. 
Guys, I love, I, I literally love all of them. You know, this is the problem. But, you know, like I think what it gives you, the, it gives you the ideas of what Mijen is capable of. But we, of course, there's not really, well, well I wouldn't know how to do these rich colors normally if it wasn't for this stylized, uh, this tuner. So it's really good that it sort of like, sort of like allows us to explore me journey more and get the colors that we want. I really wanted the colors like this for a long time, but yeah. Okay. So we've got here quite a few. Let me just try and rerun this. It's good. We've got quite a few houses in one image. Oh my God. This is gorgeous as well, guys. And as you can see, you know, like even the relaxed mode is quite fast. So I'm going to probably use all my fast hours to, to use the tuner and then, you know, go on to, oh my God, look at this. Yeah, guys, it's just, yeah. So guys, it was, it's really straightforward, isn't it? You know, like once you get to this page, it's basically just, uh, you know, clicking on the style that you like. And then it's sort of like, um, this is more traditional as well. It then you just sort of like then go on and um, just have fun. This is again, more traditional. This is very nice guys so i hope that you're going to have a lot of fun with this i am so in love with this feature i can't tell you um of course you know i will be creating more more artworks you know let me know what you would like to see um and then we can create that as well but um yes unbelievable unbelievable feature guys so thank you so much for watching if you have any comments please pop them underneath this video and i will get back to you when I can and I'll see you in the next tutorial. Thank you so much.